Hello everyone, it's your boy B3, back with another kicking cards for sale video. We are going to get into more like complete sets and hauls soon. I got a bunch of cards on the way. And uh, sometimes if I have a small amount of things for sale and a small amount of things in a haul, I'll just like show them all in the same video. But yeah, so today we're looking at Pokemon again because that's mostly what sells, so it's mostly what I list. Even though we will have more Power Rangers and Dragon Ball Super in the future as well as sports and other things. But, uh, today I got a, a nice thick stack for you, as well as some other stuff. Uh, we're gonna do the same thing you usually do, where I take kind of the more common things, and then go backwards towards the rarer things. And the last card you see in this video will be something really cool. But first, I'm gonna show you four of a kinds. Now, I kinda do this thing with lots of my bulk, where I'll get four of the same exact card, and I will just sell all four of them together for one small price instead of selling them individually it just you know it thins out my bulk faster it's easier it's cheaper for you guys and i with pokemon i do four of a kind since you can have four cards of the same name in a deck i also do four of a kind of dragon ball super and uh three of a kind with Yu Gi Oh. Uh, so I'm going to show you lots of these three of a kinds, or four of a kinds first. Uh, first up we have the Hidden Fates Magikarp. I really like the art on this guy, uh, with all the Magikarp jumping out of the water. It's really cool. Uh, just a nice, fun little Magikarp card. It takes any kind of energy. Real nice. And all of these are currently listed, but I'll be listing these after I record the video, so I can't give you prices on them, but the shipping will be 70 cents. Yeah. All right, so that's the Magikarp from Hidden Fates. Lots of these are Hidden Fates. Uh, next up is Hidden Fates Slowpoke. Uh, it's very unique Slowpoke art because you never see like a determined or angry Slowpoke kind of card, which I feel like makes this art really unique. Another four of a kind uh, right there. That's fun, right? Yeah, ooh uh, We also got Hidden Fates Star U. So if you need any star you, uh, that'll be cool. And this is actually a good card. Like, uh, you know, for just a little basic that can take any energy. This ain't a bad little card at all. 10 damage, flip a coin if your opponent, if heads your opponent's active Pokemon's paralyzed. This is a good early game basic, I think. So we'll just put that over there. We're mostly doing water types because we're going into this Psyduck. Uh, cute little guy. Psyduck's one of my faves. Just... <laughs> He really is, just because he's so funny looking, and I like Misty's Psyduck in the show a lot. Four of a kind, Hidden Fates Psyduck. All right, we're going to keep the same symbol but change the type to ice with this Snom. This one's not Hidden Fates because Hidden Fates came out before this Pokemon did. This one is Shining Fates. If you're wondering, oh, why is he doing so many Hidden Fates and Shining Fates first? It's just because those were limited sets. That's why, and so even some of the commons can be a bit harder to find because the sets were so limited. But if you did manage to get your hands on a lot of them, then you might have a lot of the same commons just because, like, Hidden Fates only had 68 cards in total, minus like, the secrets, and then Shining had 72, which isn't much more at all. Like, at all. So, yeah, all those snoms, and they got Call for Family, which is always a useful attack, you know. And, uh, I got something else involved in this later. That'll be fun. So, next up, we have the Hidden Fates Jigglypuff. Another one, oh, excuse me, that I really like the art for it was, like, the flowers and the musical notes. I think that's probably some underrated art. And, uh, this one I have eight of, <laughs> somehow. Uh, so, yeah, I'll have two of these for sale. It'll be the same listing. It'll just have quantity two, and you can pick how many you want. So if you pick both, you'll get eight. But, uh, if you pick just one, you'll get four. Move that over to the side there. And, uh, next up, to keep the fairy train going, we're just going to kind of group them by, uh, type here. Uh, we have the Clefairy. Also really nice art with the several Clefairies and the moon, you know because that's where the Pokemon's rumored to come from, is the moon. So, four of a kind for that one. It has two attacks. Uh, most of these have one, but both the fairies I just showed you have two. We're going to move into normal types. We got 
everybody's favorite, Eevee. Nice fan favorite. Uh, this one I also have eight of. <laughs> and these are all near mint, by the way. Uh, opened, never played with. So yeah, there will be two four-packs of this Eevee. Place it right back on the other side of me. Next up, we have Charmander. I recently sold some Hidden Fates, um, Charmeleons. I sold a Reverse Hollow Charmeleon. I need to list my non-Reverse Hollows, but yep, four of the Hidden Fates, Charmander. You know, Charmander is a fan favorite. Uh, it's Final Evolution. Charizard is probably the most popular Pokemon of all time. So yeah, that's really cool. Hidden Fates, Charmander. Boop, we'll put that back over here. And then we have a Hidden Fates Voltorb. I like the art on this one, too. It's kind of simple, but you get a good, you know, <laughs> idea of what it's about. So that's the Hidden Fates Voltorb. And next, uh, we're going to kind of start going into Uncommons. So, four of a kind, Uncommon Luxio, which evolves into my favorite Pokemon, Luxray. Uh, it's got ability, decent attack, you know, so you can get four of a kind, uh... This is actually Shining Fates, Lucio. And then the last one for now, Hidden Fates, uh, Misty's Cerulean Gym, which is an uncommon stadium card that works with water Pokemon. So yeah, that's all really fun. Now we're going to move into this. So, uh, flip it over. And it's mostly hollows today. First up, a hollow Brock's Training. From Hidden Fates, Near Mint. A lot of these cards are just 99 cents. Uh, from Hidden Fates, we have a Hollow Jesse and James, and not just one, we actually have Tree. So that's three Near Mint Jesse and James. Then we have Misty's Water Command, also Hollow from Hidden Fates. A lot of Hidden Fates this video. Uh, and we have four of this supporter card. Wah wah wee wah. Yeah, so if you're running a water deck, uh, you know, this might be a good one to pick up. And those are sold as individuals, not four of a kind. And I did hint at this. This is the Shining Fates Frost Moth, which I really like the art of. I'm a big moth guy, and I just like this type of hollow in the art. So this Frost Moth actually goes with the Snom I showed earlier, if you want to pick both up. This one, I believe, is also 99 cents. I think everything I've showed so far is 99 cents. This one is, this is the Evolving Skies Kiram. Another rare holographic. This one, Dragon. Very nice. And then we have this, Malamar. Another holo rare. Malamar is a Pokemon that I use hefty in another deck. We have a holo Rhyperior. I really like the art where it's like pulling air into the hole to shoot rocks at you. That's a cool one. We have a holo rare a Go Goat. I like goats IRL too, so that's fun. And then the big prize of the video, a nice Sabrina's Gengar. This one is an auction. All those cards you just saw are 99 cents uh, with the top loader penny sleeve. But this Gengar is um, it's an auction starting at like $24.50. Really cool from Gym Heroes. Uh, I'd say it's between Near Mint and Nightly Played. You can see a full spiral right there. Really cool vintage card. Pretty hard to find in good condition. There's a few scratches on the hollow, but that's pretty much it. Yeah, it's it's in very good condition for its age and etc. So, you know, quick recap. Sabrina's Gengar, Go Goat, Rhyperior, Malamar, Kiram, Frost Moth, as well as Misty's Water Command. Jesse and James and Barack's training along with all of the uh, four packs. So that's it. Thank you all very much for your support. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Check out all the cool links in the description below, Facebook, Twitter, etc. And I'll see you all next time.